spiritual diary from Ukraine, spring 2022. April 10th, the 46th day of the war, Palm Sunday. This year I had a very good Palm Sunday. I did not have to give a running commentary on the broadcast with the Pope celebrating the Mass as I usually do and therefore I could spend Palm Sunday in the parish among the people. The last few days in our city have been very quiet, with almost no air sirens. It seems like life is getting better. In the city there are more people on the streets going to work and more cars on the roads. Even in the parish the number of people has increased. If it was not for the news and the horrors of the war in the occupied territories, it seems the war is over. Palm Sunday itself is always a sign of change in people's moods. At first people enthusiastically greet Jesus as their king and miracle worker, but in a few days they shout, crucify him. They forget so easily how he was praised and glorified. I have the impression that the zeal for conversion in the beginning of the war is slowly fading. It is safer in the city, so it is not so scary. And if it is not so scary, then maybe God is not so necessary. This is our human thinking. I don't want to lose the grace of sensitivity to God's presence that I had in the beginning of the war and which touches my heart now. I am afraid that at some point my heart will stop being sensitive. Therefore, I ask the Lord for the gift of a living relationship with Him and a sensitive heart. A heart that loves equally in times of trouble and in times of joy. Amen. May the Blessed Virgin help us to enter into the depths of experiencing this great and holy week. A Spiritual Diary from Ukraine Produced by Rita Radio Norway